Woods National Monument is a popular destination among tourists coming to visit San Francisco. It is located north of the Golden Gate Bridge and allows to combine these two attractions into one tour. The only downside of Muir Woods is the limited parking, and to be honest, it is a problem. There are many parking lots, but they are all packed by the middle of the day, and you would have to walk a long distance to the entrance. This is why the best way to visit this place is on a tour bus. This is exactly what we did. Our first impression was that this park really represents the typical redwood forest but unlike many other nearby parks, it is more developed, meaning that the main trail is wheelchair accessible, paved, and has plenty of interpretive signs on the way. The landscape is picturesque and you will have many opportunities for great pictures. The light coming from above the tall canopy in a combination with some mist creates three-dimensional feeling of an enchanted forest. Large trunks of the redwood trees dwarf the people nearby, changing the scale of things and your perspective. From the scientific point of view, these huge trees contribute significantly to the utilization of the greenhouse gas, or CO2, and turn massive amounts of it into biomass and oxygen every day. According to official information, the average age of the trees here is six to eight hundred years. The oldest one is over a thousand years old. Our walk started on a trail along a creek. Then we crossed the creek using one of the several bridges and took the narrow pass on the slope of the hill to see the place from above. People come here to enjoy nature from all over the world. John Muir, who was a naturalist and ecological activist and really deserved to have his name on the title of this national monument, once wrote, Everybody needs beauty as well as bread places to play in and pray in, where nature may heal and give strength to body and soul. This national monument is clean and well maintained, although natural features are quite typical and can be observed in many other less crowded parks in the Bay Area. If you decide to check this place out, remember that the easier way to visit the Muir Woods would be a bus, ride sharing, or even taxi and keep in mind that there is no Wi-Fi or cell service over there. Thanks for watching. Leave your comments and have a great time exploring California.